Welcome to another episode, guys. Give it a little stir. to another episode guys so last week we went to Fraser Island and did a tinny mission with the boys and the last couple of nights we've been staying at Childers which is a beautiful little country town awesome spot eh? yeah and just sussing out where we want to go next what we want to do that sort of thing but what are we up to this week well we're this week we are going to well we're going to start Kincuna and then work from here um, which is, I don't know how many minutes south of Bundy, but it's only a little stone's throw. Uh, we're going to go down this road and the camping apparently can get right down on the beach. So we're going to suss that out and maybe camp one or two nights and then we'll see what happens from there. Yep. So I think there's a bit of sand to get to this spot. So it'll be interesting. We'll take the van on another bit of sand, see how we go. Hopefully it's not too soft. <laughs> It's not too bad the first little bit getting into this joint too. It's just a gravel road to a drive. Anyway, who knows? We'll see. Put the tires down. <laughs> yeah, trying to do it. <laughs> Soft day. Eh? Are you doing anything to help? No. No, I know. No, Why not? Not. <laughs> Way to go. <laughs> Don't know if we're gonna get through through here, eh? That looks pretty tight for the van. Let's see what's down here. Oh, this must be beach access. Yeah, it is. What did you find out? That there was a lot of low branches. Huh? If we had a pop top, we'd be fine, but we don't. We have a full light van, so we've got to keep going. See if we can get down the beach some other way. Yeah, we finally found a spot where we can get the, the van in. It's not so much the length that's the problem, it's the height of the van, all the trees on the edge of the thing, but have a go at that. Another beachfront camp. This what an awesome spot. Wow. Dig it, dig it. Work it, girl, work it. Up, up, up. So we are here, we've picked a spot without fighting this time. Um, 
such a beautiful spot. I think we'll stay here for a minimum of two nights. It is a national park, Kinkuna camping area, and you just sort of camp along the whole beach, which is really nice. Um, yeah, your normal national park fees, so $13 a night to stay here. I reckon beats a caravan park. But that's the way we like it though. So, gonna make some wraps for lunch and then I think I'll see if I've got a cold cider and I'll just probably sit here and watch the world go by. <laughs> This is one of my pet hates. <laughs> Alanya cutting cheese. You can't cut straight. <laughs> it looks all right. It's a wedge. Still be right. Go! Ah, Mandy boy. Yay! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Yay! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Watch out! Mum's booties going everywhere. Someone dug a hole so we put Finny in it. Get me in the boot. Woohoo! Daddy, 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 hey, daddy, daddy. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> <laughs> daddy, can we have a bath now, please? Oh, what now? Thank you. Do that. Say, see you later. I am so excited. This is our first fire that we've had since leaving Christmas time. So I'm really excited. We're going to have it on the beach tonight and probably cook dinner on it. This is our fire pit. Super easy. Light, literally. That is it. <laughs> Super quick to do. Nick. <laughs> God love him. He ended up making a bag for it. I think you can buy bags, but Nick ended up making one for it, so it's super little. That's all it is, like that. And it just fits in the car as the canopy, like the canopy of the car. So super good, super light, easy to deal with, easy to set up, easy to pack away. And we've got these little things to go on top. So more gourmet cooking from me. <laughs> well, it'd be rude not to do a cooking segment for this one while well, we're using the fire. So what we're making is bag bowl. So, a bit of meat I prepared earlier. Just chuck it in. A bit of onion that Nick cut up for me because I don't like onion ham. A bit of chopped tomato. tomato. Bit of four bean mix for your protein. And some tomato paste. I'll have to get a spoon for that. Look more bean in it. And it's on the fire. And Bob's your uncle. Something about cooking on the fire, Ooh. eh? Yeah. Especially. It's got a view like that. And spreading the kids are even better, aren't they? Yep. No bonus. Love it. <laughs> Ooh. Mummies, how much does mummy get? One. Oh, one. Not a bad spot. What do you reckon, Lennox? Did mum do good? My eyes. Awesome. N nice. No, you're, more. you're a mute. You want more? <laughs> Yum. Tea time. In front of that. We're going to uh, eat this tea and we're going to probably go to bed after that. So we'll see you in the morning. Good morning. It's time for our morning dip. It's become a bit of a ritual here, eh? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> The plan for today is not much, we haven't got much planned, but we're gonna go at the end of this national park, down that way, there's a little creek, and we're gonna try and cast net some 
bait because we got none for some some we crab trap. Yeah, <laughs> we want to catch a fish, but we need crab trap bait and all that. So we're going to take a little mission, and we're going to teach Lenya how to throw the cast net. I can we'll see it. if we can get some bait, but for now, we're going to have a swim. Awesome track, it just weaves its way along the beach, eh? Such a cool little drive. Delania's first time flying and catching the drone. Oh. Got him! <laughs> it's a lot harder than it looks, isn't it? So halfway through our adventure, it's pretty tight and pretty soft sand. <laughs> Nick's just asked me to get out and have a look. We're gonna hit. Don't uh, know. Just do it slowly. Yeah, I think you'll be good. Keep going. Oh. <laughs> I just touched that back bit. He's tight. <laughs> Keep going. So we don't really know where we're going, but we're going and it's nice and tight. This little track to the room has got a bit of everything. I just <laughs> said I led you out crossing this little waterhole thing. <laughs> She's loving it. Things you do. The things you do to get a good video. What the hell? Yeah. Give it a go then, big boy. Daddy scopes out where we can get fishies. Then we're having some snacks, aren't we? Bucket. Would you like to put him in, Lennox? Do you want to hold the fishy? No, you won't eat anything. Ah, quick, 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 quick. <laughs> so, we've come down the end of all that four-wheel drive track. This is Woodgate. Little beach, hey, it's cool. Crystal clear water. Sonia's having a swim with the boys. Lennox is in. And we have bait. Look at that big boy. Look at that big boy, Lennox. 
It's gonna be some good crab bait. About a thousand casts. Do you wanna have a go at Tarst and Dale? Pardon? Do you wanna have a go? Yeah. Here we go, lanyards up. Put that around your wrist. Your little wrist in there, that in your right arm. In my right arm. So you throw an arm. And pull tight. And then you coil that up with yeah. your right arm. And then I normally yeah, so put your index finger out. And then you grab here at the bottom. Let that go. And you do that and then keep grabbing this side. To the left. Yeah. And I normally bunch about five up. Two, three, four. Five. Oh, look at him. Yeah, yeah, I can't get him out. <laughs> <laughs> and then grab, yeah, with that arm, and then just sling, sling with your right arm, yeah, and then hold on to the left arm for a bit until you think. And there's a Lennox fish out there, catch him. Nice. Then when you see a fish or something, or maybe just have a practice. Oh wow! <laughs> that was actually pretty good. That was very good. Good work, Mummy, eh? Okay. Have you done this before? I've done it once, maybe like three years ago. <laughs> We're in Townsville actually. Yeah. Do you want to see if you can catch a fish? Yeah. Here's Lenny. Oh, she spotted a fish. She's going for it. Lenny, move. Lenny's is getting a pain in the neck. <gasps> she's got, she's done the throw and it's not very good. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be mean. We're learning. Thanks. How good is this little idea? Yeah, it's a lifesaver. All right, this is our little teeny mission water 10 litre. And we've been putting it inside our because we've got nothing in this angle fridge, our car fridge. So we've got 10 litres of icy cold water. So good. <laughs> so good that it's hot up here. Right, well, we're going to head back to camp. But um, yeah, Woodgate, what a lovely spot, eh? Just come down for a swim. Everyone's swimming, so there's no crocs. Everyone's parked on the beach down there. But um, it's lunchtime and the boys are tired and um, cranky, hungry, all the rest. So are we, so we're going to get back to camp. You driving? Yeah. We're signing off for another night. Well, then you can't help yourself though. Look at her. I'm getting a bit sick on this thing. How are you getting down? Look <laughs> <laughs> at the colours. That's it for another day. King Kuna, how good? What's Daddy catching? Fishies? Alright. Yeah. Watch video though. So I'm gonna go and get Min. So these are what I catch a little hardy heads. I think that's what they call them here. But just stock up while they're there because I reckon they'd be awesome bait. Minnie loves them. Minnie. I think he's gonna be a fishing one. So that was a good little uh, little session on the cast net, wasn't it, Dale? 
Sure was. Got our bait for the next couple of weeks. Look at that. Didn't even have to go for a drive yesterday. We could have just stayed here. Got it straight off the beach, literally just out there. <laughs> well, that's that's how we do it. We package them in like individual little packets like this. But that's bait for like the next four or five fishing trips, eh? That's awesome. I love Queensland. The cast work, it's cast net paid for itself already. Yeah, well, literally, like probably that's probably five, five bucks, five, ten, twenty bucks, twenty, thirty bucks worth of bait. Plus yesterday with the mullet, yeah, 30 bucks. <laughs> Happy boy. Yeah.